So it's been a week and I got COVID. <laughs> so after two and a half years of washing my hands to the song of Happy Birthday twice, to wearing face masks and all that, unfortunately on Friday I succumbed to the virus known as COVID-19. Now I don't want to bore you too much because I like to think that for those who are watching and um, I've all experienced having this virus and it's not pleasant, we all know that. Um, so I don't want to keep you going on about it for too long but just in terms of a story, Thursday evening I felt a bit under the weather and my go-to sign for a cold is a really scratchy, irritated throat. When I woke up on Friday, it took me a long time to wake up on Friday. When I woke up on Friday, I was feeling quite heavy-headed, like my head was predominantly just lead. <laughs> that rhymes. That rhymes, doesn't it? So when I woke up, it literally was my body first and then my head felt like it was just like it was just it just felt really heavy so i thought you know what while i'm getting ready um in the bathroom i'll set a test away and then when i come back i'll be okay thinking it was just a cold it's the common cold oh how wrong was i <laughs> i came back and i've never seen red lines so full um so naturally that was my running with coronavirus and my weekend was pretty much written out i was that ill couldn't leave the bed it took me forever to get out of bed, like a good half an hour, just to try and move. Um, I tried to move myself from the bed to the chair here, um, and that took forever. And even going to, to the bathroom felt like a chore. So Saturday and Sunday were just me sitting in the house, resting. And bless me mother, she uh, she brought tins of soup and, and what have you just to keep us going, because my luck, um, there was nothing in the house. So... Um, rude so yeah that, that that was my running with covid um disappointed because i was you know getting you know, some kind of good rhythm with the running sleep group and i was you know i'm enjoying me running again but not being able to run it feels like forever since i've not been able to run it was only it's only been like a week or so now um and it's a bloody shame <laughs> but i'm kind of hoping that next week i can introduce myself into running um, the plan is hopefully to start testing negative soon because I'm still testing positive which is really frustrating um, and you know I don't feel poop I don't feel bad um, so hopefully I'll start testing negative by the weekend and then I think I might just try a mile just to get in the swing of it um, and see what happens but it, it, there's not much I can do within the four walls of this flat um, other than work from home, watch TV on me downtime, set up a, a now an office now, complete with LEDs. So yeah, in ter I never thought I'd miss running, and that's the thing. Um, but it, when you see your friends talk about the running group and just how things are going, I got a bit, I got a bit envious. I'm not gonna lie. I just, I miss it, and I never thought I'd miss running again, but I do. So that's a positive thing going forward into next week, where hopefully I feel a bit better. Um, so fingers crossed. But also, um, while we're at it, uh, hopefully going forward with the videos, I have mentioned about finding my action camera, or getting another one. Um, I found it. <laughs> so now I can start going out for runs, not taking this, but to... Why is there always a moped that has to make that much noise? It's still going! So hopefully I'll be able to take this, not you, this out for runs. And um, yeah, that, it, it's exciting because now I, I have this to, to run with and it's... Um, I, I, I wish I could... I wish I knew where I found it. It was located at the bottom of one of my boxes, but it's just so nice that I found this. So, um, that's exciting, isn't it? So, yeah. Well, we're gonna go to this camera now. So now I've got an action camera. 
we can go out and do runs. Um, it might not be too much on the running sleep route because, uh, well, it just, I feel it's, it, it, I just feel it's a bit weird with stuff like that. But in terms of going out for a, a trail run on my own or just going for a casual run, of course, if it's a, an event I'm going to train for, I'll bang that out and bring it with us, especially if it's a great north run. So that's something to look forward to and it is nice to know still that there's love for the videos. Um, thank you to everyone that's like reached out and that and wished as well um, with when I had COVID. I'm sorry if you're looking forward to the video um, on the Friday. Uh, hopefully when this comes out, this will fill your Friday slot. Um, and I might try and get another video done over the weekend because there's a lot of stuff I want to talk about um, in terms of, of going forward with what I want to do with running. Um, so that's a video for another time, but there's just a quick stop gap from last week to let you know that I got the Rona, I'm okay, found my action camera, let's crack on, basically. So enjoy the rest of your weekend, um, have a glorious weekend, enjoy your running whatever you're doing, and keep an eye out for the socials, and I'll see you next week. <laughs>